What's going on, everybody? A little bit of a different video, kind of a follow-up video I did many years ago. I want to see roughly, probably about three years ago. The 1990 Fleer Jose Yorubi uh, rookie card. And it went into, was it money laundering going on with some crazy prices on this stuff to everything there is out there? And I, I've been getting a lot of comments over the past couple months. I guess maybe YouTube's promoting it or something. I, I have no idea. But I want to talk about this. So, these are the sales. These are confirmed, been paid for over the last two years. One cent to $15,000. Somebody paid $15,000 for this card. So, I want to look at this just to show you guys that people are still buying these. I want to make sure I have this on sold. Yeah, I do. All right. So, this is not a peak. This means somebody actually paid for the item. It didn't go and didn't go unpaid, all that stuff. If you guys look, in 2022, there only five of them sold that I could find. I believe this is... No, wait. Wrong way. Let me go like that. Nope, that's 2021. 2022, so a total of 647 have sold. Most recently, $20, $1.25, $25. I mean, the birth year is an error on this, from what I do recall, but 15, 10, 12, dollar, 495, 99, 1 cent, 130, 25. You guys get the picture. As of in October, you had some at $70 and $85 that were actually paid for. $130 for a PSA 10. $130 for a rare. Uh, for a rare. For uh, a raw. $26, $25, $180. $150. That's in September. So I'm going to flip this real quick. I think this should go from high to low. Nope, I did it wrong. We'll do it the other way. Some of the craziest sales, guys. October 11th, 2021, during hype. Somebody probably bought into somebody out there saying this thing's like so valuable and rare. Paid $15,000. Raw. These are confirmed sales that the transaction did go through. $9,718.33 in May of 2021. $5,000 2021 in July, $4,500 in July, June, August that year, $4,000 for PSA 9, $2,000, $1,200,000, those are all in 2021, January 2022, $950, but just look at these prices, They're, it's all over $500, this is like a 10 cent card to me, it should be. Look at all the all those are over a hundred dollars. The biggest one though, somebody really paid in the thousands for it. Fifteen thousand dollars. Crazy. Now I can't sit there and say people are laundering money and it, you know it's drug money or whatever it is out there. Because during this time frame, people came into this not being aware. When they were buying stuff, they were buying the hype out there. The old Pump and dump. The hanky panky that's called off of, uh, I forget whose channel that is. Is it a AIH? Something like that. I might be wrong. Might be giving the credit to the wrong person. But these were paid through, through eBay for these insane amounts of money. I mean, we could say the same thing about a Luca Silver, Luca Base Prison being 1800 Now it's like 350 ish. But still, this is like a 10 cent card. So this is just a follow-up video to show people are still buying these. Not at the obscene, absurd, I should say, values that we've seen in the past. I think 2022, what was the highest one it was paid for? January 950. But if you start looking for later in the year, that's 500. I don't know if there's one. Oh, September 200. So there are some there later on, error card, birth date, all this stuff written on to it. But I wanted to share this kind of an update video. Insane. Hear what you guys have to think about it. Because, you know, a lot of times you're like, oh, the sale never went through. No, the, these on Terror Peak mean the person paid for them. I could balance this off of the eBay sold listings and show there's a ton that didn't come on here. And I've showed this before with Terror Peak as well, too. But wow. Wow. I, I 
I can't believe it's still selling for that kind of money. We'll see in a few more years. We'll get, will we see other big sales over a thousand for it or not? I don't know. All right, guys. I'm out. Catch you next one.